talking about online, since well, the last time we were here, Ian had three subscribers. No, I had 127. 127. And what you're yeah. now? I had, I had 127 subscribers, and I had my my YouTube channel for two years, but I'd done nothing with it. And I'm just short of 40,000 in just about four months. Yeah, amazing. All thanks to you, mate. Thank you. Wow. It, well, we, well, should we talk about that as well, uh, just before we start? So yeah. Yeah. Um, the, the Stylish Blow Up Blueprint is what uh, we've been working yeah. on. Yeah. And it, it's basically a, a rundown of, of, we used Ian as a, as a case study, how to go from 127 subscribers to what we wanted was a thousand. A thousand we wanted. In, in like we 10 weeks. A thousand by Christmas, remember? Yeah, yeah, ten weeks, wasn't it? It started in October, October the seventh, and I wanted to get to a thousand by Christmas. Yeah, and I actually by Christmas I actually had hit ten thousand. Yeah, by following the strategy that you set out for. Yeah, I'm just going to jump on my YouTube for one second, but yeah, you, like, so the strategy is very, very simple, isn't it? Just give them like a teaser of of what we did, but but don't um, give it away. Yeah, well, basically, you gave me a, a program of, first of all, you showed me how to edit, which is like, for me, a technophobe. It was so simple. That was like the best thing. And uh, unlike you on your YouTube, you use your, your laptop a lot. I'm yeah. actually using my, I only use my phone. I have done yeah. stuff on my laptop, but I find that more challenging. And I'm, I'm going to break that this year. I'm going to be more laptop oriented. But at the moment, I'm doing everything on my on my phone. Which mm. is so easy, is so accessible, um, and then you give me a strategy, and we talked about the strategy and what I should do, and it was about making sure I was looking at my time, my times I was posting, looking at the, my demographics, what I was looking at, all of those things, and it was so easy. Like I can't, it was so simple actually. It wasn't so, it was so simple, not easy, but once I followed it and I got into habit. It's just a habit. And now I just do it every day. I've just been away skiing for a week and I set content, believe it or not, to just do automatically while I was away. I didn't even look at my YouTube while I was away. But I still gained something like a thousand subscribers while I was skiing, which is like incredible. And actually, Paul, I've got over 10 million now, finally. Yeah. So, yeah, 10 million, uh, 10 million, 200,000. What, views, in 90 days? 90 days. So I can now monetize. Awesome. So I'm so happy with that. Obviously, that was the aim to get there eventually. And as a backup with that, my, I do my normal all shorts. And now uh, my long form has taken off. Now I'm having, I'm having like eight, ten thousand views on my long form, which I haven't had before. For some, so it's, it's yeah. like feeding into that now. People are getting interested in what I'm doing on my long form as well as my shorts. So and my shorts are at ten million, ten in ninety days. I've had ten million two hundred and fifty thousand views. Wow. Um, where do you find the time to work? It's honestly, it's like, it takes minutes. It did take me longer. Initially, it took me like probably, um, how long? Probably 15 minutes to edit one video. But it's a secret to it. I only film like two videos a week, maybe three videos a week, which are like nine minutes long, 10 minutes yeah. long max. Um, usually shorter, seven to 10 minutes, I'd say. And then I edit those down into shorts. And I got a, out of two haircuts, I have a week full of content for my YouTube. And it's like genius. It's like unbelievable. I know you smiling, but it's, it's like a proud, proud daddy moment, isn't it? Well, the, the strategy worked. Yeah. Yeah. It's it worked. Been, it's, been, it's been phenomenal. I've got, I've got to yeah. be honest with you guys. And it, so, it, um, worked for, it worked for everybody. So as soon as. Yeah, yeah, I mean, we need to we need to get a course or or, so, or maybe something on here. I don't know, but yeah, we've we've got something. We've got that we on Facebook. We have, yeah. Well, thanks, Wendy. Wendy, you've you've seen it all, and Wendy would testify that I was probably the least techno person in the whole of the Joico Europe team, even worse than David Murray, I'd say. But I was always yeah. open to doing things. I just didn't know how, and now I've got yeah. it. It's kind of, I just enjoy. I, I actually enjoy it as well. As it's become a real. It's, it's given me like a, a, a new outlook on hairdressing, on, on how I look at haircutting, how I look at my clients, all of those things. It's, it's reinvigorated my, my career. Like, you know, and I, I really am, I'm so thankful. So I'm really, really happy and blessed that I've, 
I've come across you know, the people I've had who support me, like you, and and you know, obviously the people in Jolica Europe. You know, we couldn't do this without, you know. But yeah. it's like phenomenal. Anyway, enough about that. Uh, was uh, I've grown a lot, Wendy says. Um, yeah, I think it's fun and not like it's, it's, and, and instead of all the trouble. Yeah, it's, it, it, it used to be so much trouble. So yeah, and it is it is it has it is fun now, and I just like uh, it is just cool. 